Yes, for this home. That's what we love the most. See, the radio is down there, and I'm far, far away. And we'll keep hovering. the intelligent orientation control. So right now it's facing to my side. I mean the face is towards me. If I push forward it will come towards me. If I go down on elevator it will go farther. Right is left and left is right. Okay if I put it to intelligent orientation control now when i push this stick elevator down instead of going farther it's going closer as the face is facing outwards now however face is facing me elevator up it's going farther at actually it should come towards me left is left right is right so orientation has completely changed as soon as i uh, turn off the intelligent orientation control left right is left left is right you can see orientation is reversed so that's why many beginners feel nose in flying is very difficult but intelligent orientation control will simply make it go farther come closer go left go right no matter where is the head pointing and uh, home lock means the same, uh, the quadcopter will always lock its face towards home. So you have to experiment with these settings, actually. And I will highly suggest experiment these settings once the quadcopter is in GPS position hold mode. All right? So for now, this one is behaving really nice. Let me give it a try on uh, manual mode. That's what I love about You can fly fast FPV on manual mode. And as soon as you see something interesting, put it on GPS position hold mode and go hands free. All right, so this one is done. We're gonna test the another one. This one is going to be shipped to Australia, I believe. Steve, L-O-W-E, Steve. The name is right here on the radio, Steve. So Steve, this one is coming at you, all right? Flying sweet, everything works perfect. I'm gonna pack it and add your FPV system to it and ship it to you.